we can start off with your name and age. I'm Shay, and I'm 37. How you doing, Shay? I'm doing amazing. Shay, uh, what do you do? Um, so I work for the county, and I have my own hair business and a few other little small businesses. Okay. All right. And uh, why did you end up popping your balloon? So originally I was feeling it. I, I, I like a, I don't want to say a bad boy, but I like somebody that's outspoken. But mm-hmm. the question of, I feel like you're challenging the women. Oh, how many baby daddies you got? And then... You know, it's it just, that's, it, does that matter? You say future, so that's they past, it's not they future. How many uh, kids do you have? I have one daughter, she's 19. Do you want more? I do. My balloon still pop because I don't want any more. Okay. You don't want any more? <laughs> not at all. I have you a, can't I have, have any more? You, you, no, you I'm choose not I to, choose have, not to have any more. I have an okay. uh, almost 14-year-old. And okay, yeah. Well, the reason for me asking their past about the baby daddies because it lets me know where they're going in their future. If you didn't, didn't want to have a baby daddy for the second time, then that lets me know that you was uncareful of what you're dealing with. Do you necessarily okay. believe that somebody's past is their past that don't determine their future? Not, because, not, I mean, I can look at you and say, say, like, you, you, you made, people make mistakes. And it could happen. I, I feel like once or twice, okay, some things become a choice, but no, your no, past no. doesn't determine. When it comes to w- once, is a mistake. Twice, that's on you. Okay, so then, say, like, you get into a relationship with somebody, you get married, and things don't work. So then, I guess you made a mistake? Or, and then, so you, once is a mistake, and then twice is, I don't believe in that, because I believe... Things happen. Sweetheart, twice is on you. Okay. You well, should have learned from that very no, first mistake. It, it, okay. Are and to not be saying that your child is a mistake, right? Mm-hmm. Of course. But the not. fact that you chose the wrong man to have kids with. And secondly, not to have a marriage after the next one mm-hmm. or before marriage the next doesn't one. Determine, and I'm, I'm a person that wants to be married, but marriage don't determine anything. I've known people to be married for a long time and it don't work out, baby. So, okay. yeah, you are, no, honey, buddy, okay. you, you're too aggressive now. No problem. Oh, well, you know, uh, the aggressiveness, that comes from a southern man, uh, right? Baby, let me explain and we stand too. on what we're talking about. Our roots about. come from Texas, so. Mm. Okay, I'm from no. New Orleans. Okay, so you, you know what I mean? South, so the when battles you, of the South. Right, like Brian, said, Brian, let's move okay. on. Let's move on. Let's no move problem. On. Have a good day, love. I would never understand women who always say, oh, you hurt, just because a man don't want a woman with multiple baby daddies. It's always funny how a woman's past don't matter when she ran through or had multiple kids with different men. Having multiple baby daddies is not a past. Those guys will always be those kids' fathers, and that could be problematic going forward. I don't know why that's so hard for women to understand. Seriously, why is this such a difficult concept for women to understand? It's not about shaming anyone for their past, but let's be real. Multiple baby daddies is not just a footnote in someone's history. It is a potential recipe for drama and complications down the road. Imagine trying to navigate relationships with all those different fathers in the picture. And let's not forget the impact on the kids. It is not just about a woman's choices. It's about how those choices affect their children's lives. Stability and consistency matter, especially when there are multiple parental figures involved. So yeah, it does matter how many baby daddies someone has, not because of judgment, but because it's a real life factor that can affect relationships and family dynamics. But hey, let me know what you think in the comments down below.